Okay, today I'm going to do a chicken pot pie in the XL power pressure cooker. And I'm using some baby carrots. I'm going to try this for my first time. Pizza crust, I don't know. We'll see how it turns out. Uh, green beans, cream of mushroom, cream of celery, cream of chicken, sweet peas, half onion, and some filthy uh, cream cheese. What we're going to do, uh, what I'm going to do to speed up the process though, is I'm going to saute the onions in this ready, set, go, and then I'm going to do the chicken tenders on my uh, chicken tenders. I'm going to cook them on the new wave, and then I'm going to put them in the uh, XL pot, and we'll go from there. Okay, sorry, I forgot to mention, um, I'm going to do four red potatoes. I'm just going to cut them, slice them up, dice them, and throw them into the recipe. That's how many carrots I'm going to use. I'm going to cut those up as well. I just saw that it was... Uh, saute the onions in the ready set go uh, little cooker next thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do eight pieces of chicken in a new wave just to get it ready because they're they're frozen I'm gonna, and then I'm gonna throw them into the uh, power pressure cooker what I did was I uh, mixed the potatoes the carrots the peas the green beans and I uh, seasoned them with uh, cayenne pepper a little bit of cayenne pepper salt pepper and uh, garlic powder and paprika and then I just mixed it in here because I'm gonna dump all this all these ingredients into the uh, Excel pot what I'm gonna go ahead and do right now is I'm gonna this cream cheese I'm gonna melt it up and then uh, then that's when I'm gonna dump the um, the chicken in there and mix it up real good okay okay so this is the chicken and the uh, cheese and together I mixed it together I don't think I have enough chicken in here, so I'm just going to throw in some ham, like four slices of turkey. I just sliced it up. I'm going to throw that in there as well. Okay, what I have now is the uh, cream cheese, the chicken, the turkey ham, and I uh, put the sautéed onions right on top. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to put the... I've never done this before, so we'll see how it turns out. But uh, I'm going to put the, the pizza crust, a layer, on top of this, and then I'm going to throw in all the mixed vegetables and then another layer of the crust and then we'll see how it turns out okay so now we have a pizza crust layer underneath the mixed vegetables so I'm gonna what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna um, dump in the cream of mushroom cream of celery and the cream of chicken okay so here's everything incorporated I kind of mix the uh, all the mushrooms uh, the um, mushroom soup and the celery I mixed it all kind of mixed the best vegetables with it a little bit and then I put the dough on top I'm gonna put it for 12 minutes I'm gonna see see what happens here okay once again it's on the XL power pressure cooker it's chicken pot pie I'm trying it for the first time put it on for 12 minutes get back at you after 12 Okay, well, what happened was uh, after 12 minutes, I didn't think it was finished. So what I did was I put it for another five and I let it um, release it itself. So it's on the warm mode right now, but I haven't tasted it yet. I'm going to taste it here in a minute. Okay, the bread's incorporated into the um, pot pie. I don't know if you can see that, it's kind of blurry, but um, it came out good. Overall, it's good. I guess I would just use the biscuits uh, on the next try, but... Uh, other than that, it, it came out okay. I will try the biscuits next time, but the pizza crust came out. Turned out good.